images are a great way to add interest and information to your infographic. You can always upload images from your hard drive by choosing Insert Image, Upload from Computer. But I think unless you have a very specific image you want to use, Search the Web is actually an easier method. If I choose Search the Web, a search string comes up, and I'll type in CrossFit. This isn't a specific graphic I want. I just wanted a little graphic in my title to make it more interesting. Sometimes you might want a transparent background. If that's the case, here's a tip. Whatever you're searching for, just write the word transparent behind it. And now all of these will have a transparent background. I'm going to choose this image so I can select it and click the insert button and it adds the image to my slide. Clearly I need this to be much smaller. So what I'll do is use the squares in any of the corners to drag this in and make it smaller. And then I can add it by dragging it up here. I can add it to my header. Now one of the things that we can do is we can crop this image. So you can choose the crop tool and you can use the black lines here to crop out some of the excess dead space if you want, but you don't have to, especially with this particular image. And then to get out of the crop, you just click the crop tool again. If we choose the image and select format options, you'll see the things that we are used to seeing, the size, rotation, and position. But there's also an interesting option here, which is recolor. In the case of this particular graphic, the black and gray don't look that great on the blue. I want them to stand out a little bit more. So if I choose recolor, I can select from any of these options. So I can make that yellow or orange. The next thing I'm gonna show you is gonna to put together all of the things that we just learned here about images. And I'm gonna create a graphic that shows that Four out of five women prefer CrossFit training. So we're going to add an image. Insert image, search the web for person icon. And I'm going to choose this one and insert. I'm going to use the grabber bars to resize it. I'm going to use the crop tool to get rid of the dead space on the side. copy it and paste it five times and I'm going to recolor one of them to show that four out of five prefer this. So I'll choose the last one, choose the format option, recolor, and I'll make this one blue. So four out of five. So in that one we got the image, shrunk the image, cropped the image, recolored the image.